I'm so proud of my dad. He worked so hard in helping Ren the last two weeks in building the deck for our pool. As you can see behind me are the end results of this deck. In this video, we will show you how to make this deck, so stick around. Hello, this is Zoli Mugger, and I'll show you how this deck was done. What you need is wood glue, craft sticks, paint, paint brushes, and a box. Make sure you have a box that opens like so. Cut the top flap off your box like so. Three sticks you will have to glue up and down and then the rest of the sticks glue in between the up and down sticks in a horizontal fashion. To make these horizontal sticks fit, you will have to cut off a curved end off of each stick. To do the long sides of your box, start off by putting a craft stick diagonally on each end of the box and then horizontally put three craft sticks to form three columns. For your three columns of sticks you will need full sticks for the right and left columns and then for the middle column it will need to be cut to size to fit in between the right and left column. Remember the lid on the box that you had to cut off? Well, cut the folding part off that lid and then put it on top of the finished box and simply glue. Then take your craft sticks, glue them into three columns, full craft sticks, into a horizontal pattern. This should be laid down in three columns, and if you want to do the bottom of your deck like this, it should be done in this fashion as well. When you're done with that, then flip the box over and glue the sticks in a diagonal fashion. They should be glued in two columns, so they should look like this. Zoli, look what I found in my craft room. That's great. We can use them for braces for railing. Just take some craft sticks and glue them diagonally onto the braces for railing. And then take more craft sticks and glue them horizontally onto the diagonal craft sticks, like so. Then when we're done with the railing, we can trim everything on the outside and the inside like so. And here is the finished product after we have trimmed inside and out. And now we're going to paint the deck. Unfortunately, it's going to be pink, but that's how Melissa wants it. Look what else I found in my craft room, Zoli. Guess what these could be used for? 
Stand up those rough edges first, friend. Then position them just right and glue them together. Well, look at that, Zoli. Looks like we made us a pair of stairs. So I decided to paint the stairs beige, and I didn't glue it to the deck in case I make another dowel setting that needs a set of stairs. Now we have somewhere to sit and relax by the pool, and I better get in all my pool time because pretty soon I have to go back to school. Remember to have adult supervision when working on this project. And don't forget to subscribe to Double Styles. Have yourself a wonderful summer day.